Hello YouTube, uh, Daniel here. I just thought I'd do a quick review on a TP-Link network card I just picked up. Uh, this is a gigabit PCI network adapter as you can see. 1000 megabits or 1 gigabytes per second. And the model number is TG3269. Inside the box. I've had TP-Link products before, they're quite decent. You don't pay a lot for them but they're quite reliable. That's one thing I'd say about TP-Link. Um, I think I've got maybe three or four of the gigabit switches and I've had a access, I've got a wireless access point as well and it's all been really reliable. I've not had any problems with any of it. <coughs> Excuse me. So bought this from Amazon, I think it's about six pound. And um, it look, the packaging looks quite nice. The only thing I did spot is there's a couple of spelling mistakes. Let's see if I can focus that in. It says um, streaming and um, something about file downloads as well on it. But you'd think they would have checked that. But anyway, that's, apart from that, that's all right, right. I literally just got this, so I've left it in the cellophane. Right, so look. So that's what we got. I'm guessing that's for low profile machines. You can swap it out. manual um, quick installation guide. I won't really need that, I'll just plug it in and hopefully it picks it up. It's to replace a network card, an onboard um, network card on one of my servers. It's 100 megabits, is isn't fast enough. Um, what's this? Some compliance thing. Little CD, if I need it. Uh, warranty. This is just standard stuff they give you. Give, give the products. Right, that's nothing else in the box. Right, this is it. Um, I'm not going to take this out at the moment because I haven't got um, uh, the proper wristband that I normally put on when I'm handling this sort of stuff. But basically, you can see there's the RJ45 port. You've got activity, you've got your, your different types of speeds. Uh, it's got Full duplex, 1,100. I think they all light up when you got it on one gigabit. A real tech chip. Um, and if you were, if you did need it as a lower profile, low profile machine, that's full PCI slot height, and then you could just swap it out with that. And the screws are there and there. It's really easy. So yeah, that's it. Thanks very much.